been a busy, 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 busy few weeks for me. And I know the last time I left off, I said that I would vlog again a week later. And I'm so sorry. And um, it's just been hectic. And so today I figured I would vlog my adventures. Um, we are currently in New Jersey. But later, we're going to hit the streets of NY. If the weather permits. Yeah, but the forecast says it's supposed to rain today, so we'll see. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and get ready, guys, and I'll see you in a bit. All right, guys, I am ready to get my day started. Just straighten my hair, and we're going to go to the mall first. And I'll see you guys later. We are headed to the mall, guys. We're going to check out American Dream Mall in East Rutherford. I'm going to do that again. In East Rutherford. Say for your boy. East Rutherford. <laughs> East Rutherford, New Jersey. A tongue twister, East Rutherford. It's good on camera. Because I was overthinking it too, yeah. Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray. And then I also need some lipstick um, or lip tint. And then maybe even some lip liner. And I'm really digging the, what is this, the Honey Beige or, um, sorry, kind of blurry, or the sandy beige. Uh, it looks really nice. And I'm a fan of the Huda line. So, oh, and the Silk Balm. I'm so glad I stumbled upon that. It's like magic. And so that's why we already have it in the bag. And I think I'm going to go for Crush. Crush looks really nice. I already have Wifey. And Sugar Mama looks really good, but Crush is where it's at. So we're going to go ahead and grab that. I really only need just a few things, but yeah. Sorry, blurry. Um, but yeah. And then now we're going to go ahead and get some foundation. I use um, I use Dior, the 24-hour wear high perfection matte foundation because I'm very oily. So I cannot use... Uh, oil-based products and my shade is 4N. There you are. So that's the Makeup Forever by Dior. So we have the Silk Balm. I picked up some Jo Malone as well um, for the bathroom and then the foundation that I was showing you guys earlier and then the lipstick, the Urban Decay, and then I really just needed a few things. What else? Um, this lip liner. And I actually went for terracotta because it was really pretty. And I thought it would go well with what I picked out for lip tint. So, yeah. Let's go ahead and pay for this stuff. All right. So, like I said, I only really needed a few things um, that I didn't bring with me. And it came out to two ten sixty nine. So, and then also, yeah, I picked up some more Jo Malone because Jo Malone is love. And there it is. Thanks so much. We're going to head on over and keep walking. So we have some Jo Malone, some Sephora, and I think we're going to check out some clothing stores. This store, um, Designer's Market, let's go in here. 
yeah, the clothes are not bad. I'm not necessarily in love with what I'm seeing, though, but we're going to keep walking. Um, see if maybe I can find something. Yeah. Yeah. All right, so I didn't think I liked anything in the store, but then I saw these pants, and I figured I'd try them on just to kind of see. So here's the first pair. What do we think about these jeans, you guys? How do we... Do you like it? I mean, the fit is not very flattering. I don't know how I feel about this. It's like baggy and like just not. It's just not doing it for me. I'm sorry. What do you guys think? Is it a what? Yay? Nay? What? How do we feel? I don't know. I don't know. I just don't. What about these? Okay. The length? Yay. Um, color, yay, but nah. I'm just not loving these um, either, so it's not going to be, yeah. So I found um, these. So I found this jacket, and then I found some more jeans. So let's give these a try. All right, so jacket. It's a must. Like, I love this. This is very nice. I like the fit, the style, how it feels. The jeans, I think these are, these are like the same ones that I tried on earlier. Yeah. See? Same pockets. Yeah, these are the same ones. I'm not digging how these are um, making my butt look. So, yeah, we're not going to go for these, but the jacket... Yeah, it's a yay for me. Definitely. Let's ask my husband. Daddy. Hello? Daddy. He's not paying attention to me. There he is. What do you think? Yay, nay? What do you think? Let me just show you. Let me turn around. I think these are the same ones. All right, I wasn't really digging anything else but the uh, jacket, but the uh, girls wanted to get some jeans and um, a shirt, so we're going to go ahead and get these for the girls and see what else we can find elsewhere. So, yeah, hi. <laughs> Cute. You guys, my husband is like the best person to go shopping with because he's patient and, I mean, he's my husband, so I value his opinion, so that's why um, I wouldn't want to go shopping with anyone else. So we just got a few items from the store. They just didn't... It, None of this stuff just worked out for me. So let's go get our bags. All right, let's head on out. All right, here you go, Tina. And where's your sister? Shimini, here's your bag. Come get it, please. Come on. All right, so we're going to go into this store and see what they have. All right, so um, Balenciaga. Uh, another Balenciaga jacket. It's oversized. And these hideous, what are these, off-white jeans? Yep. 770. Hideous. No, thank you. And I think those are from, uh, those are men's jeans, yeah, definitely. Um, What else is here? This Amiri shirt, though, really cute. And then there's this um, green off-white shirt. What size is this thing? I think it's a, uh, what size are you? I think it's an extra small. Yeah, it's an extra small. Uh, yeah, no, some more off-white. Uh, nope. I think this is a men's store, you guys. Let's see, yeah, a lot of these items are men's sizes. Like, I'm not seeing anything 
that would fit me. They also have some shoes back there. Um, this Burberry shirt, definitely a men's shirt. A lot of these shirts are, or actually all of them are. Let's see what else they have. So back here they have some Dior, definitely. Yeah, this is a men's shirt. I mean, it would be cute otherwise, though, if it was a women's shirt, like fitted. Um, let's see what size. Yeah, seven ninety and super big. Oh, sorry. Oh gosh, I'm making a mess. Sorry. Let me just pick it up and yeah, this is hard trying to vlog and put things back and hang things up and yeah, just hang on. Bear with me a moment. Sorry. I'm a one woman show. All right, there you go. So this Christian Dior uh, shirt is definitely a men's shirt. Uh, yes. These are all. This one too. Yeah. Seven fifty. This is definitely a men's shirt. It says multi size, but no, it's too big. That's not gonna work. Yeah. Nothing here. Okay. You guys, this mall is really beautiful. Just do you just see how shiny, how how bright everything is? So there's the Tiffany and Company store there. The chandeliers love. And then just look at the entryway, how everything is lit. Like, it's very nice how they put this thing together. I like this mall a lot, actually. Yeah, very nice. And then the display, the murals on the wall. Look at the ceiling. Isn't she lovely? That's really nice. And look how colorful. I just love the whole glass and colorful combination. What's this door here? Yeah. Not familiar with it. Not even going to try to pronounce it. There's Mulberry over on the other side there. Um, look down there. Look at the fountain. Really cute. I love it. And then look at these sculptures. It's like oversized topiaries. Really super duper nice. I love it. Nice. I mean, the display, well lit. Very chic. Everything just screams chic. So I'm really digging this mall. To the left, there is the Dolce and Gabbana store. Beside it is Saint Laurent, and then, but you know what, Saint Laurent is not open yet, and I think they're opening in a couple of weeks, so um, we're just a couple weeks shy of um, the opening, and then to the right here is the walkway to the restrooms, very nice, it's a nice touch, and then the brown building there, that's the Hermes store. But we're going to head on over to Saks Fifth and fi see what we can find. We need me a birthday fit, so. Oh, this Alice and Olivia shirt. Very cute. Let's see what else is there. Um, Digging that dress there. Uh, oh, leather. Cute. What else? No. But this dress... It's very summery. It's like it's giving me like the Kuji vibe. I just don't know how I feel about it for the fall though, but it's really super cute. And I, I don't think I would want this as my birthday, birthday fit. Yeah. But it is cute. It's nice. You know, it's bright. It's, it's a fresh looking shirt or dress yeah so alice and olivia once again i'm really digging this brand um this is a size small my size this right here is what let's see this is a size um 36 so also my size this dress or this skirt is uh 250 okay very cute 
and this shirt is also for 250 so very cute i like the combination but let's head on over to balenciaga check this shirt dress out uh, no yeah this one that's also you know yeah no um nope no yeah no uh, yeah this one i really want to love but i don't i just don't so let's see what else is there more balenciaga items no not digging the color no some t-shirts yeah what size is this let's see uh yeah it's a small but it's very casual i don't know if this is what i would want to wear for my birthday uh, as a birthday fit nah nah maybe like a lounge just like as a lounge shirt maybe but look kind of, it looks kind of faded i'm not digging the whole faded look so not into it but let's what size is this thing let's see why am i having so much trouble it's a size small is it really that one's okay that's not bad it's like cropped though i'm not feeling that let's look at some Balmain. oh let's see what size is this this is a 30 what 30 uh let's say 36 yeah this is giving me kylie jenner vibes like this is something she would wear um some more balmain nah not really digging it nah these pants 1750 $1,750 for those ugly pants. No thanks. Not digging it. Um, leopard print. Not today. Let's see what else. Uh, Givenchy. Yeah, this shirt could probably fit my 12-year-old daughter. Let's see. What's, let, let me see what size this is. I know this is not the youth section, so let me just see. This is a size, what? A small? No way. Let me see. What about the one? Right, wait, hang on. Let me see. No way this is a small. Is it really? Uh, yep. Yeah. Wow, that's tiny. I'm not that tiny. So, uh, that's a no. Oh my gosh. Ugh. It's just, uh, de it's definitely not worth it. Not for, I don't know, it's just very mundane. That's what it's giving me. This one here, no. It'd be cute if it was like form fitting, but it's, yeah, it's not. It's very boxy. So I'm not digging this. What size is this even? Maybe this is like a large or an extra large. It's very boxy. Um, Pink. I love pink, but I'm not going for pink today. Let's go to Versace. See what Versace has. Let's see. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I'm not sure I'm, I'm digging any of these. Um, nope. Yeah. Uh, no. Uh, yeah. I really want to love these, but I just can't get myself to love these items here. What about here? What is this? Very bright, but no. No, thank you. Um, I'm really digging the beige and the black, so these are all the items that we're going to try out, okay? All right, so this is the first outfit. This is Alice and Olivia. What do you think, guys? What do you think? Okay, second fit. All right, so this is the second outfit, and we are not feeling this color. This color combo. 
probably just wash this one out. So, no, no to this. Alright, so this is the third outfit. I'm digging it. It's a size medium though, so I think I would benefit from getting a small. It's really cute. This gives it no justice, but it's really super cute. I just went from a medium to a small down to an extra small and what like I'm confused now I thought I was a small but I fit the extra small you guys Super cute. Guys, yeah, so we got our stuff from Saks Fifth. I didn't show you guys which one I chose because I don't know. I ended up deciding last minute, so. All right, so we've left New Jersey. We're now in Manhattan for dinner, so let's go. We just parked at the Marriott. The restaurant. This way, this way, this way. Good. I'm feeling junior today, so we're gonna go to junior, guys. That's where we're headed. Guys, we're eating outside, so we are at Outdoors, so New York City um, to be eating inside, they require proof of vaccination, which we didn't bring. So we decided to eat outdoors. Okay, so we're gonna have dinner on one of Junior's because I wanted their cheesecake, so might as well just have dinner here. Um, I hope you guys can hear me, but and then next up, we'll probably roam um, Times Square. I'll take it there too. All right, we're walking around now. We're done with dinner. We got us some juniors to go. All right. All right, so we're just gonna go ahead and walk around Times Square. Um, it's densely populated per usual. Um, we're gonna go ahead and head on over to the M&M store here shortly and get the girls some stuff. So here we are. The last time we were here, Reese, um, didn't really know what was going on, but now she's older, so she can appreciate it better. We're just getting the girls some stuff. We just got back from the M&M store, and we got some shirts and candy and stuff, so yeah. Okay. All right, guys, for our final destination, we're going to head on over to Carlos's Bake Shop in New York locations um, for my cake guys and then I got a free apron. I got a free apron down here. That's nice man. Hey guys, thank you for hanging out with me today. My birthday is officially over. It is midnight. So thank you and for my birthday giveaway remember to 
just email me your good deed for the year um, and in the subject line put birthday giveaway 2021 and you must um, describe your good deed, good deed for the year using only 120 characters okay um, and then also um, in the end to um, put down your prize selection whether it's cash or mystery box okay so make sure to follow the mechanics because I've already been flooded with a ton of emails and it's a lot to sort through so only using 120 characters I don't care if you do it in English or in Tagalog but just make sure that it's 120 characters Okay, thank you guys so much, and winner will be announced on September 25th. Thank you. Love, love, love.